okay guys welcome back to my channel how are we all doing this is uh, another video that we are here to share with you you know um it is true that most of us are not aware of what is going on you know in nigeria and where Igbo people are being placed in nigeria even though some of those some of our so-called elders that are supposed to know better are pretending and lying to us that everything is all right but you know a child have grown to know his left and right is no longer a child isn't it so we know what is going on and we can tell what our people are facing in nigeria this picture you are watching now okay is a picture of um, the current uh, british prince uh, not prince a king you know when he visited nigeria and pay attention to the you know structure that is holding nigeria today you may like if you like if you're happy slave you may say okay oh there's nothing wrong with it it's all just ordinary picture but some pictures have a very significant meaning and the meaning is what we are here to discuss now this man on the red cap you are seeing here he happened to be the Igbo, 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 Igbo traditional ruler or you may say king isn't it now the next to the to him he are you know kings from the north or traditional rulers from the north in the middle is the man who presents himself as the owner of all this stooge. Now, this is Oba of Benin, of um, Benin at the back, with a red cap as well. Okay, and some of them have their own um, a kind of uh, people that are representing them and all that. I think Oba of Benin, they called him and all that. But just pay attention to the position of these people, these traditional rulers, where they place their chairs and how they represent the so-called kingdom and all that what we are seeing here is the current state of nigeria all right look at where Igbo man look at where they put him not even closer not even in line or whatsoever in fact even beneath you in line in nigerian structure than him now the one from the north and all of them they, 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 are, they are the one making kings and uh, the one i'm talking about the british british man all of them are the one making kings. He remember his king in Britain, and he's presenting himself as a superior and a god here, as you can see. So this is what is going on in Nigeria, and people don't pay attention to this. Then after you know uh, insulting this uh, Igbo man, he will not come down to start. He start telling that he's the king. Look at on the Guru Gabon. Okay? This is it. And if you tell him, okay, oh, Papa, this uh, treatment is uh, is wrong, you are better than this, he will tell you, no, don't worry, we are Nigerian, the Nigerian we shall be. Uh, the, even the that uh, the prince, prince uh, and I always say prince, that the king of Eng England they actually handshake him, you know, that makes him, that he, valid he validated his uh, kingship and he, he recognized them. But they don't pay attention, he will do everything to take your mind away from the real information, which is the position by which they, you know, welcome, how they welcome this man like the way they put his chairs and everything and people who claim that they look at your bad man and look at their what not and ask you see where they are and this is how they and guess what what makes these people to come together as a as a group comes from where from this one here from excuse me from this very man okay we come from this very man and that is natural resources and south south oh we are south south and the south 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 maybe seven south before you get to the south people that come from those areas where is your own uh, representative fa, 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 fa. and guess what this one will not plant wiki and people like him politicians will be in your village dictating to you what you have to do and we will be you know reporting to them through government which is this one is the government itself do you understand and before you know it you are under the leadership of this man here and just like the one in here there's a reason why they, they drag this uh only closer in the front and put the oba great oba of benin at back there's a reason the reason is because they believe that 
you guys in Benin, you the, you the king, kings, are actually from this place. In fact, you are just like um, an extension of Ilefe kingdom. Do you understand? So, this is what is playing out, and this man is enjoying the whole stuff. The whole thing. Is it the right thing to do? That's my question. Is it the right thing to do, or you pretend not to see what you are seeing? When you ask some evil people, they will tell you, don't don't say that, don't say that, you know, don't, 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 you are, you are trying to cause problems. Don't bring problems that, um, you, you know, this is your graph of a thing, and this you, this thing you guys are doing is not how to do it. No, okay, say me, don't be, don't be further than your shadow, don't run from your shadow. Okay, say me. Then you ask him how, how are they actually doing it, so that you will learn from them. He will end up yapping nonsense. We have a lot of different mentality, different um, different reasoning. People that feel they know everything but anything in our midst. That is why you see somebody will come out to criticize Mazda Magana. And now all of them are in love with Mazda Magana because he's in detention, and uh, which is good. But let me just remind you, there are many, many, many Igbo people, many of them were against Mazda Magana, including the Kenga. He would let that started asking as if he loved Mazan Mukan. No, don't do that at home. You're actually trying to take for argument that they, they should use it, use it against him. Lawyer, you are not. Lawmaker, you are not. You don't know anything about how to how to fight free for freedom, and you don't want to learn. That's a big problem. Now, let me know which much of your time because I don't want the video to be too long. You can see I just want to record this video so that you will see and learn something from this. Because when you hear them attacking PM these days. That has been the trend. They have done it to Mass Number in the past. Hear this guy that I'm about to share with you. Listen to him. This very guy here. Okay? And this uh start um, online defenders are the ones sharing this video now. They are sharing it not because they they love this guy, no. They are trying to remind you that you should lay hands on something to hate yourself or to turn against yourself, which many people have done, and they, they are enjoying it. They are enjoying it very, very, very well. But it's not going to last. It won't last, of course. How, how, how will it last? It can't last. Just hear what somebody is saying against Mazda Mondragon in the past. I am trying to to get you know bring it for you so you can hear. Just listen. I greet everyone who have interest for the betterment of people and for the Biafra in large. Yeah, there are a lot of things I want to say in this video, and uh, I want you to give me your listening ear for you to understand the coming from. And uh, I don't want you to cut the video on the way. Like I said, I'm a Biafra. Every Igbo man, you're a Biafra, and uh, anybody around the world knows that you're a Biafra. Yeah, I have never attacked Biafra, and uh, I have good mind and interest of Igbo people and uh, I really wish well that Chukukita Biyama will make it to pass for Biafra to come to my own generation. It's a very happy thing. But to look at what I am attacking, what I am standing against what is for this good Lord who I have attacked. He said, look at what I am attacking, what I am standing against. He actually used the word attacking. Do you understand it? Deliberate action. Listen. Biafra who have attacked Biafra parading itself as the leader of IPOB. Why is not the one that formed IPOB? You don't know how they start that actualization of Biafra. You see, uh, the last time I said, many people, many IPOB people start embossing me, start asking me a question. Why do you say that any IPOB people is foolish? No, I did not say that you're foolish. But I said that anyone that is foolishly following in land, the Kalo, is very stupid. Because you cannot tell me you follow a leader that you cannot be questioned. That you cannot, whatever he said, you accept it. Because he's called the same that he's fighting for actualization of Biafra. But what he's doing is out of the actualization of Biafra. And you people don't want to open your eyes to understand, to read the handwriting of the world, that this man is not taking you people anywhere. But you foolishly want to believe whatever he's talking about that he's telling you people. There are many things that I like about him. There are many things that I like about him. I will not tell you that whatever that he's doing is pure wrong. No. He's doing many things right. But what I am here to attack is for him to stop saying that he's working for actualization.
actualization of Biafra. Why is killing Biafra? Why is not doing anything for actualization of Biafra? What? Why what he's doing is to, to fight for his own pocket and fill his pockets? You understand? I want us to understand it where he's taking us. I want us to understand where he's going. If you cannot question your leader, if you cannot come out and condemn where he's wrong, that means you're foolish, you're very stupid. You understand? Even when I ask many IPOB people that have been imposing me, what is he doing right? They will go out of their front, their, their front topic, say that he's attacking from a DS man, he's doing this. Is that what you will do to get their front? Upon all he's attacking the Funani men, does he stop Funani men to invent evil land? Does he stop all the killing? Does he stop anything? You see that what he's doing is out of the line. I'm not against what secret or many way he attack Nigeria. Me, I have done a video that I, I have attacked Nigeria. I am not in support of what is happening in Nigeria. But all I'm saying is this guy is not working for actualization of Biafra. What he's doing is not doing it where he's supposed to be. And when you emboss me, I will tell you a lot of things that he's doing that he's not doing it right. The guy is selfish. He's working for his own pocket, not for actualization of Biafra. By the time you get it into your head, you will understand it. What he's doing is out of what he's supposed to be doing. Get it into your head. And there are many proofs, there are many things that, in fact, sometimes when I come out here to say it, when I, many of them that have been brainwashed, all these IPOD people start attacking me. You cannot just come out to my comment to comment nonsense. Impose me. I don't block people. I will tell you a lot of things, which not any time that I come out in video, but Maybe what I will do is to bring a slate board to write it like Kujeron has on primary school. I want to tell many people that have been saying that they will do this, they will do that, they will do that. All Nemo State, kind of, we all are Nemo State. No IPOB tomorrow can stop me along the road and talk nonsense. I will shoot you. No, about what you will have, you will have IPOB, you will have IPOB, and nothing will happen. All Nemo State, kind of. If you people don't want to respect yourself, okay. I wanted to allow him to finish yapping what he's saying, what he was yapping. But did you get what he said here? That he that he's in a because this guy said that he's from Imo State. That we are in Imo State. If you do nonsense, that he will kill you and use IPB clothes and cover you. You know, say tag you terrorist. Are you getting the point? Where Nigerian army, I learn what that what they're doing. This is pure a slave. Do you understand it? That he will kill you and use IPOB, actually, guy. That bringing you know dead, dead guns and uh, Biafra flag, charms, you know knives and everything. Go, bring it and put you know beside you and tag you terrorist. Listen, just a moment. I will make him stay too hot for people and I to stay. I am telling you the truth. I am not going to collect anybody to walk my way to talk nonsense. First come, first collect. If you people don't want to respect yourself in this industry, I will make it too hot for you to stay. This man has been watching people, and you people are moving along the street as a new Latin. When he was saying this, it was when the France IBB was protesting, current flag. Do you understand? Now I dare him to even make him open up and I dare you to make him. You see what I mean? You, are you getting the point? This is the reason why the African government chose what they what they what what they are doing now, which is to make sure that if you want peace, prepare for war. That's the method, and it's not working. It's working. He said you make him say on blah 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 yeah babu gi wori bright ipo be close yeah guy and people you know that are like this some of these uh, guys that are from Edo, like a uh, wounded civilian they are the one sharing it and you know telling you oh see this guy is a true nigerian he understand everything and listen you people don't want to respect yourself in this 
people don't want to pay attention. You see where these people is leading you people. To learn from your past mistakes. Let's come together. Let's build Biafra. Stop contributing money for anybody. That money you're contributing will not be Biafra. You don't need to spend money to get Biafra. I am telling this, this cap. <laughs> you don't need to spend money to bring, bring Biafra. Now, maybe he will tell us how to bring Biafra with that money. L listen, because I don't want to judge him. Let me, because to be honest with you, I am listening to this video, to this lens for the first time. I have not. So this is my first time of playing this video to this lens. I will just play a little part of it at the beginning. I said, okay, let me react on this. This, this foolish man, they can stop taking money from innocent Biafra in the name of IPOP. Because if you people stop contributing money for the macro area, get it into your head. This guy is brainwashing you people for you not to see rules. But I pray, I pray to go to Kabiam and we expose him one day to the Amen. All I want to tell you is that if you don't know what you're doing as an IP movie, you want your Jiro Mwiki. Go near more London or have each year, but I cannot attract you on the roads. Because what is going to happen in Imo State in next time? Any IPOB people block me, or I see any IPOB doing any protest or anything that is going to be a block share. I am telling you people the truth. Stay out of Imo State. Who will you think about Afra? Who will you think about Aka State? Stay out of Imo State, or else, or else, I will make you people to feel too hot in Imo State. I'm in Imo State, I'm in Imo State. This Imo State now. Let's let's bet. Let's see who we're wrong. Now, the same people said this is people that I started there. Uh, you know, they feel who pose that who 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 them as a look. They feel they no quantity. It made a first of what they did today. Just like the way I am crying to people of Enugu State and Anambra State, that learn from what is going on in Nimo State. You can't eat your cake or have it. It no matter how you pretend not to be aware of what is playing as you yourself are the instigator. So, if somebody made, just for you to understand, because IPOB, DOS, all of them were chatting, oh, man, so you know, when this guy is making this kind of video, and nobody noticed, noticed him, right? And even if, there's, even if they lay hands on this video, they will say, just, uh, what now, let's talk, let's talk, what now? These are people that are, they are listening to. And many of them, you know, are in Imbo State. And this thing is what give Imo State what it is today. Because they started bragging and trying to show, do a grammar, you are this, you are that. Today, Imo State is not the headquarter of the agitation. Because you choose Imo State to be. As a citizen of the indigenous of Imo State, you choose Imo State to be. Because you open the door for federal government to build tent in Imo State. And by so doing, the government will react. You can't see such video at this, this present time. And remember, when he made it, it was when Mazagan was still broadcasting from London years ago. It's not new video, okay? Years ago, you see, DOS and uh, their group, he, he, you know, none of them have ever reacted to this video or to tra trace what this guy he hold within a year and I'm taking a can that I will kill people and he he said he will kill people and they use their fan you know, costume and claim that the person is a, is a terrorist, which the same thing they did to Ikoso, the same thing they did to many, many Biafran. When they was they kill, because they will go to market and buy Biafran flag and sew it and bring cutlass, jackknife, dagger, you know, then go dead gun and all that, because they don't have what it takes to make it look like red Biafran, isn't it? Then Biafran were using placards and uh, flag protesting, marching on the street. An individual like this with a um, Saudi Arabia uh, uh, scarf on his shoulder telling you how he will deal with you people, how he will do that. And he said that freely and nothing happened. Nobody noticed his presence and you want to tell me that it's uh, by an accident? No, 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 no. Something must have, you know, must have gingered this guy to say what he said, what he said. And maybe he actually contributed in killing, you know, reference. Maybe because he bragged about it. And he's boast, he boasts about it that he's gonna commit a, a murder because of uh, because you are doing Biafra. And he said that Master Kano is not the one that formed the IPOB. 
that uh, he's uh, he's lying to you that he uh, that people that formed the IPUB that he hijacked the IPUB. In another story, there's no story, story just to tell you that this guy is out from nowhere trying to undermine the activities of Biafra and said what he said. But maybe he will come across this video and he, he I believe that he must be regretting it. And if I thought he's still alive, because for him to the kind of anger, the kind of um, mindset and plan he have against Biafra, I don't think that this guy is still, still living because maybe he, he have done one or two things, you know, Biafra responded and all that. I cannot tell, but maybe you know in nigeria sometimes when you fight against your own people the nigerian state will be used their hand and send the president to judgment to gun and such a quickly since you people don't want to get the handwriting on the wall i've told you people i've worked once work for this boy i've sacrificed my life i once worked for them foolish fine boy cannot come out and deny that he don't know me my next video, I'm going to play the first load of conversation on air at all. And you people are going to watch it. That I didn't come out to talk nonsense. These people didn't treat me well. Why I do this video this evening? Stay out of the new states. Any IP. They will only more light. If you are more light, stop anything in IP. Let there be peace. Let's come together and work for actualization of the Afra. Where you will not spend the money. Where you will not contribute to money for anybody go to come on their way demo lights outside you people should listen to it this guy is coming you people stop contributing money for any nonsense woman jobless woman be name to in the name of biafra you will not get biafra this way let's work together how we get biafra and let's remain in peace together we stand divided for this guy have succeeded in dividing biafra land dividing the people with the name of IPO. By the time you people your life, it will be better for you. And for us to stay in the most in the for you. Shopo is on our set there. I've warned you people. I've, I've warned you people for the last time. For the last time. For the time. Now, this is the threat that he made. Every day, over 1,300. Now, this is the threat that he made. Okay? That he will do this, he will do that. The question is, why? Do you understand why? And what did the IPB, you know, did to him? He said he have worked with the Mazan Kano and Fine Boy. I don't know who is calling Fine Boy because sometimes they call younger brother of Mazan Kano Fine Boy. I don't know if, if he's referring to mom, if his younger brother or Mazan Kano himself. But the question, like I said, is why? Do you understand? Self hate is there, and he said that he can get Biafra without spending any money. That's a, that is alone is to tell you that he's a criminal, confirmed criminal. There's no way. I am not part of IPB government. In this. I am not in government. Not that I am in support of government, but I am not in the a cabinet. That's what I mean by that. So I am not um, a member of Biafra uh, government in Nezai cabinet. So. So you will not say that, oh, you are trying to defend, he's not defending, but let's to, to be told, if we do what people are saying, for example, today, you can't tell me that they will get uh, do what without money. It's a, it's a lie, you can't get it. You have to do one or two things, and even him that is talking, can you defend and fight for Nigeria that you are fighting for without money? He said, lie, you can't. Because money, money, you have to use money to do most of even the broker that he made now, he's he have he has to spend money to buy data, buy phone, buy equipment to do the broadcast that they are doing. So, my people, what do you think about what this guy said? Tell me what you think about it, and we are going to you know listen to what IPOB member who happened to be in IPO who have worked with Mazam Nagan, the mindset of these people and what they believe on. Some, sometimes you wonder, are they, are, are they actually fighting for Biafra in the first place or they're just there for something else? Because people have said it in the past, they are suddenly enemies. And looking at what they're doing, you don't have any choice that to accept that totally they're they out because of the salary that, you know, the money they're making. If this is a, the one they call um, uh, the one they call the, what is the name of, one, what is name? Biafra Child. Listen to what he said here. Yes, as a, mm, yes, as a, just listen. As a, yes, as a, 
Do you understand it? You are fighting for Biafra and you are saying that uh, when they can go back again, now that Nigeria is zoo, Nigeria is still a sovereign nation. So, are you saying that you are lying to people when you say you don't even know the context behind the word calling Nigeria a zoo? It's not as if Nigeria is not a country. It's a country, but a country on, for what? That, the, that country by name, you know, on paper, but in reality, is it a country? What a country, other countries have rule of law. It, can you? Because to me, I can't even call Nigeria a zoo. I can't. Because that's an insult to animals in the zoo. I don't want it to insult innocent animals by calling Nigeria a zoo. Because some of the country where most of you are living in Europe and other parts of the world, go to the zoo of the country where you are living. They have constant power supply. Do they have it in Nigeria? So that answer your question. Okay, I don't need to say much about it. Thank you so much for your time and God bless you. Have a wonderful day. See you again. Don't forget to like this video and share it if you are new. Subscribe, all right?